In this short video I'm going to show you how to run a really really handy utility built into Windows called Check Disk. And this um, can be really handy if you've got a problem with an external hard drive. I mean it does work as well for internal drives, um, but that's a little bit different to this video because I think you have to boot into um, check, check Disk, especially if it's your drive C. So I'm not going to cover that in this video, it's, this is purely for like an external hard drive, like a USB connected hard drive. But like I say, it does work for other drives. So the problem I was having is I was going into Windows Explorer and I just couldn't access the folder in question. Um, you know, I was getting an error similar to this, like Windows can access access a specified device. I think it was slightly different to this actually, mine. It was something like um, the folder may be corrupt. Or so, you know, it's, it's error message of this sort of style anyway. So the first thing we need to do to get this working is we need to know the drive letter um, of the drive that we're wanting to repair. So if we just come into Windows Explorer, um, you can get that just in your in your programs menu, and then go into this PC, and then just look at this. I'll bring give you a breakdown of all your drives. I mean, a lot most people might only have like your drive C, and then the drive that you plugged in. But it, it doesn't really matter. But the one that I'm wanting to do is this Rux HD, and you can see there that it's got a drive letter of H. So that's all we need from that. And now we just come down to the Windows 10 search. This does look a little bit different in older versions of Windows. I'll just show you how that looks. Um, in Windows, I think this is Windows 8, um, or certainly Windows 7 it looks like this, where you click on the start button and then you get like this little search prompt here. I think this is, I think this might be 8 but dressed up to look like 7 actually, it's a, bit, a little bit confusing, but whichever version of Windows you've got, you've always got this sort of search functionality, however you get to it. Um, so Windows 10 you just click on this little Cortana search button, I think it's called that, um, and then you just type CMD and it'll bring up the um, command prompt and then if you just right click on there and say run as administrator it's important that you do run it as administrator as well or it won't work properly um, and then you'll get this uh, UAC message again that looks a little bit different in older versions of Windows and just, so just click yes to that or ok or whatever just say affirmative and then the command that we're wanting to run is just here I'll just go I'll just take a copy of it so I'll show you it first so it's chk dsk for check disk then forward slash f which is just a parameter that you can set that says I want to repair this disk then a space and then the letter of your hard drive so that's what we found out before so in my case it's H and then a colon so I'll just um, copy and paste that into um, into this command prompt here and then as soon, well, as soon as you've done that you can just press return and it'll run through the um, check disk program be aware as well I think in older versions of Windows I think prior to 10 I'm, I might be wrong there that you can't copy and paste into this command prompt so you'd have to actually type that out you know so don't be wondering why you can't copy and paste it if you're not running Windows 10 I, I'm fairly sure that I, I think that was only added in Windows 10 where you can copy and paste but again I could be wrong so if you're struggling to copy and paste just type it out so it's just check disk forward slash F space your drive letter and then a colon and then hit return it'll just it takes a few minutes to be fair to run so I'll end this video here uh, once it has run um, you can just quit out of the command prompt and all being well then you should be able to access your um, your folder and your drive correctly again okay thanks I hope that helps someone it certainly worked for me anyway cheers thanks a lot bye